Hi, thanks for joining me for the 2021 Best Ever Clinic Virtual Instruction. Uh, my name is Rich Leach. I coach with the Toronto Mets. Uh, I'm the president of Ajax Minor Baseball, and I've been a member of the Ontario Youth Team staff for the last three years. Today we're going to go over base running, um, some simple things we can do. It's very hard uh, to hit home runs, uh, but learning to be an effective base runner uh, is something we can accomplish at practice. Uh, and I know um, for a lot of you coaches out there, it's important to remember that uh, being fast is not the same as being a good base runner. So we're going to talk about some simple things that we kind of work on today, some things that can help your kids become better base runners next time they step on the field. So. I know it takes Ryan 3.6 seconds to go from, from his lead to second base on a steal. So now I can get a pop time on the catcher and I can get uh, a time to the plate on the pitcher. Then all I gotta do in my head, I gotta do some real quick math. You know, if, if the catcher is a, is a two flat and the pitcher is a one seven or a one eight to the plate and Ryan is a three six, I know the odds are in our favor that he'll be safe at second base on a steal. Right? If the catcher is a 1-9, right, and the pitcher is a 1-4, well, that's a 3-3. That math doesn't work for us. He's going to be out at second base. So now what we're going to do is we're going to talk a little bit about our secondary leads off of second base. So you'll see a lot. I mean, you know, when I was coming up and I was playing, one of the things we used to teach us was kind of get deep, right? Get, get towards the outfield and work back to the middle. For us, especially for us at, at the youth level, the levels we coach, the stolen base of third is, uh, is something we can really take advantage of. So we like to keep our guys in line with the, with the baseline. And really our primary lead off the of second base is the same for everyone, right? So basically, Ryan's gonna start both heels on the bag. He's gonna start with his left foot, left, right, left, right, left. This is our primary lead off second base for every one of our players. Once he's at this point, our secondary lead, when the pitch goes in across the plate, our secondary lead is the exact same as it is at first base. So Ryan, go ahead and take one for me. Take it from there. Same thing, athletic, balanced, right? He's in an explosive position, weights on the balls of his feet. So now he can go to third base, he can go back to second base. Right? Now we're at third base. Hundreds of different ways to score from third base, base in youth baseball. So, we want to still want to make sure that our primary and secondary are done correctly once we get here, right? So for Ryan, what we're going to do, we're going to go right, left, turn. He's going to watch the pitch come in. He slows up, so stay there. So you can see once he comes through on his secondary, weight is slightly forward on the balls of his feet. He's got his weight on that right knee. That way, if the ball gets away from the catcher, he can advance quickly, right? So you can see what he's doing here. We're going to go right, left, turn. Pitch comes in. Wait on the right foot. Oh, nothing happened. Catcher catches the ball. He returns in fair territory. So we eliminate the we eliminate the throwing lane from the catcher to take away the danger of back picks, Right? At, at, the, at the older levels, that is a danger, right? You get catchers who can really throw it. 